So I have a Toshiba Satellite P755 uh, laptop with a with a broken screen. I'm going to uh, replace the screen. And uh, the first step is basically to pull the power and uh, take the uh, battery out. So just taking the battery out. Now it's uh, safe to uh, work on this laptop. The next step is to uh, remove four screws here. They are uh, hidden behind uh, um, a, a plastic protector. So you might need a, a sharp uh, tool like a knife or uh, something to uh, remove the, uh, the sticker. Take the sticker out and take the protector out and then keep it aside. And now you have a, a screw over there. Now you basically do that, repeat that for all the four screws. So I have removed the uh, four screws uh, that's holding the and uh, holding the monitor, uh, the, the screen. So now it should be good to um, um, take, open this uh, um, protector. So now I'm praying open this uh, this front pane. So now that the screws are off, so it's a little bit tight. Either have to use something uh, sharp to uh, pry open it, so it's now coming off. You can see here, and uh, so I have. Uh, taken this uh, bezel out. It needs a little bit of prying. There are some tabs holding all along, so you have to be a uh, little patient to get, get it, but finally it'll, it'll come along. So you will uh, you see how you can take it how here, and there's, uh, uh, there's again uh, another, uh, needs a little bit of uh, patience, and uh, there, there it comes. Now you have access to your, uh, to the broken screen here. And now, now it can be uh, this can be taken and uh, replaced. So uh, the next thing would be to remove. Uh, um, there is um, three screws on this side and three screws on this side. Um, but there is a uh, there's a little bit of uh, you know, there's a tab here, so uh, that will prevent uh, that prevents access to the screw. So. What you may want to do is, uh, there are two screws here, so you basically uh, don't take it out, just uh, loosen it a bit. So, I'll loosen these two screws here, um, just a little bit, the same way here, uh, loosen, loosen them a little bit, and then uh, that should... Uh, give access to this uh, screw here so I'm going and uh, going ahead and uh, moving these screws one two three and there's uh, uh, three more on this side so I removed those uh, screws now your uh, now the uh, screen is uh, you can see the screen is, screen is free of this frame um, and uh, now uh, that should be easy now you can go ahead and uh, um, remove this uh, broken screen Good. so the the next step is to uh, disconnect the webcam cable the webcam cable is behind the screen it is it is um, connected to the uh, uh, back of the screen and it, it goes over here to the webcam so the now I'm going and uh, disconnecting the webcam uh, connector. I think it's a little, uh, it's a little uh, tricky. I think it's it's a very uh, flimsy connector. Yeah, there it goes. And uh, yeah, now the monitor is. Uh, so basically the screen is free now and uh, 
this is actually it's basically a sticker on the back so I'm taking it out so the next step is to uh, remove this uh, cable there's a connector here so the the process is to this part would be pretty sticky now I have it taken out but basically you have to be very careful you do see there is a whole lot of uh, do not touch warnings here and you take the uh, um, you be very careful when you take this uh, this is an adhesive very strong adhesive here take it out in um, minute steps so you don't basically pull it off by uh, by accident and once you do that then you're uh, you have to pay, take this uh, connector out it's still sticky once I put it back it's uh, I'm slowly uh, wiggle the connector out and there it comes and uh, yeah now that uh, now this monitor is broken monitor is garbage and that can be thrown away and uh, you can put the new one in so this is the new uh, mon new uh, screen that's to be replaced you can see it has a protective uh, it has a protector on it so we'll keep the protector on till uh, everything is installed and then we'll uh, take the protector off and uh, and uh, that'll be then it will be good to go now then i'm going to uh, install it uh, uh, onto the uh, onto the laptop here so i have the new uh, screen placed here so what i'm going to do is to uh, basically repeat the repeat the same steps that is uh, first is to uh, you know just uh, try to uh, connect it back put the connector back I'm just going to uh, slide this uh, connector in place um, I need to be careful with the sticker because it keeps sticking and uh, I don't want that to happen until I uh, until I actually slide it in As you can see, the connector is in uh, in place now. I'm just uh, sticking this uh, uh, wire back on, and uh, and then now I'm going on to uh, now it will be to connect the webcam, and it will be the re reverse process again. So I'm connecting the connector back uh, onto the webcam. So I'm connecting this uh, uh, connector to the to the webcam. That's, that's it. So, um, putting these six black screws um, on the side, um, I think this could be a. These are going to be a little tricky, I'm thinking, because they are. Uh, I think at least till I put at least one of them on it. So, I'm lining it up. And uh, so, one is on. And. Uh, then I'm going to repeat the five others and, uh, and then this screen will be in place. So, so all the screws are in place and the, uh, you know, this uh, sticky is not very, uh, it's not working well, but it doesn't matter. It, eventually it will be, uh, it'll be behind. So now I'm ready to put the bezel back. All the six screws are in place. Yeah, one thing you may want to do is if you had um, loosened these screws, make sure you uh, tighten them now that all the screws are in place and uh, these don't need to be loose anymore. So I'm tightening these uh, uh, these screws which I had uh, which I had uh, loosened uh, for uh, for uh, taking these screws out. Now the bezel can go back in place and um, once the bezel is in I'll put these four screws and then it's protectors and then battery is back and test it out. So all the four uh, screws are in place. I also put back those little plastic uh, um, covers or caps that goes on it so that the screws are hidden. Now uh, one thing you may want to uh, remember is uh, um, I had forgotten to take this uh, screen protector uh, before putting the bezel on so it was a little bit of uh, 
it was a little bit of an effort to take it out so make sure you take the uh, uh, take the screen protector out before you put the bezel on otherwise it will be a um, um, it'll be a hard thing to do so uh, now the last step is to put the uh, batteries on and then there's this pad here then that locks it in place and now I'm going to be ready to uh, put it on a power and check it out so um, thanks for watching and I hope these instructions were uh, um, are going to be helpful to you as well and uh, thanks for watching.